hello and welcome in this video tutorial I'm gonna show you how to delete a subdomain first we will look at how to delete WordPress from your subdomain and then we will delete the subdomain from our cPanel then we will see how we can delete the subdomain files from our web server and lastly we will see how we can delete the DNS records for our subdomain so that the next time somebody try to access your subdomain it does not point to your IP address so without further ado, let's begin. Alright, we are inside our cPanel. You have to log into your cPanel. Then navigate to domains and go to subdomains. And here in the subdomains, you can add and modify subdomains. You can see I have one subdomain. Let me open this domain in a new tab. As you can see, this is my subdomain and I have a blog installed on it. So let me close this and go back to cPanel. So first I will show you how to remove WordPress from your subdomain. Go to software and uh, select Softaculous app installer. And here go to installations. This will show you all the WordPress installation in your hosting. So to delete the WordPress installation, just click on this delete icon here and uh, scroll down and click on remove installation and click on OK. This will remove the WordPress installation from your subdomain. And now to remove the subdomain, go back to your cPanel and go to domains and open subdomains and scroll down in the current subdomains click on remove and then click on delete this will remove the subdomain now let's open a new tab and go to our subdomain you can see i'm getting this 403 forbidden error this is a server error now the third step is to open the file manager and uh, Navigate to public underscore HTML. Just find this folder. And here you should see a folder with your subdomain name. This is my subdomain where all the files are stored. Just right click on it and click on delete. Now let me open this in a new tab. I will open and uh, type in my address and as you can see it is taking me to a different website this usually happens when you are using a shared hosting and uh, you don't have a dedicated IP address now to remove this you have to access your Cloudflare or your DNS settings I'm using Cloudflare for my website so I will go to cloudflare.com you can go to your web hosting and access the DNS settings from there I will open the Cloudflare and uh, select my website and then go to DNS settings. So here is uh, an important step that you need to follow. You have to remove this A record that is pointing your subdomain to your IP address. It's very simple. You just have to access your DNS settings and uh, remove the A record that is pointing your subdomain to your IP address. Now let's check once again. And uh, as you can see, it is saying this site can't be reached. So today we learn how to remove WordPress from subdomain and uh, how to delete a subdomain in cPanel. Then how to delete subdomain files from your web server. And uh, what else? Uh, we also learn how to and how to delete DNS records for your subdomain. If you want more videos on cPanel, WordPress and online marketing, you can explore my channel. I have plenty of videos on those topics. And uh, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to like this video and subscribe. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.